Welcome to Make It Take It. I'm DC. Friday night college basketball. I'll link my last video that I put out in the description below if you wanted to go back and watch it, as well as my record for each sport in the description below. And I've got off to a disappointing, for me, college basketball season. I'm slightly in the positive, but I'm usually further ahead by now, so for me it's disappointing. I've been getting caught up on some line reads. Well, I like a couple games today and into this weekend, so the first one I like I put in already, and that's North Carolina State. Minus eight and a half against Pitt. We know Pitt's been a down team the last couple years, and they've had a couple decent wins so far this year. But I think North Carolina State's on another level from them returning home today. I think even if it's a competitive game, they put it over on foul shots. So I took North Carolina State minus eight and a half, and I can see that line creeping up through the day. I already see it at nine. So that's the first one I took. I didn't take the other two yet. I'm considering I might drop them in the comments later, which is Merrimack plus four and a half against Boston. Uh, Merrimack's a team I took three years ago a lot, and they covered a lot for me. They're not the same team, but they're another one of those smaller name schools. They were one of those first-year division teams that I always loved taking, like Queens and Southern Indiana this year. They were one of those a couple years ago that came out all the time. So I have my eye on that one. I think the line being four and a half, they're one and seven this year, one and seven against the spread. But they've played at UMass. They've played at Providence. They've played at Montana. A lot of all road games, except for their one non-Division one game that they won. That was their only win. So I think this line being set, it opened at three and a half so low. It makes me like Merrimack. This is one of those line reads, though, that, that I've been... Um, struggling with early in the season so I'm considering taking that one and also I don't know if I'm going to take this one or not but South Florida is a double digit favorite again today they were a double digit favorite and covered two games ago they beat St. Joe's straight up in a game that I told you they should beat St. Joe's based on the line but let alone being a favorite I don't know when the last time they've been a double digit favorite two times in the same season They've had terrible teams the last couple years, so it's worth a look. If I do anything with it, I'm going to drop it in the comments. For now, it's North Carolina State, minus the 8.5. That's my play for today. Thank you for watching. Good luck today.